Hello guys, welcome to WeFix Technology. Today I'm going to show you a quick tutorial how you can create dummy data in Laravel. Does not matter what version you are using in Laravel. It'd be 8, 9, 10 or whatever. Let's start the project. I'm going to create a new project. Let me open my terminal. Laravel new. Let's give the name factory. The new composer is going to ask some questions whether we want to start a kit or not. Let's reply that. No, we don't need this one too. No. It'll take some time and we will have a Laravel as of now, today's date, Laravel 10.2.10 version. Let's wait. Okay, let me choose my SQL database. Perfect. Seems like we're almost there. Okay, cool. Let me go to factory, the project which we created. Let me open into the VS code. So yeah, let's start from the basic. I'm going to create a factory for, let's create a model and a factory, like PHP artisan make, I'm going to say model, let's assume products, or uh, let's take it post, like it, make it more easy. And I'm going to add migration flag with it. Done. So let me create PHP artisan make factory for it. Let's name it post factory. Perfect. Done. I'm going to go to the migration part. Let's provide the table details. Let's take a string for name. Then let's make it a couple more. Let's assume one is image. Then one could be body. What else? Title, image, body. I guess that's enough. Let's take one more. I'm going to say excerpt, a sort of short description. I'm going to take it as a text. And let's say excerpt. This one's supposed to be body. I'm going to go ahead and create a migration. Migrate. Yes, we wanted to create a table and that's done. Perfect. Let me run it. Artisan serve. Let's check it out how it looks like. I'm going to go to the outputs. Perfect. That's a fresh installed Laravel project. Let's go ahead and check the database, what we have in the database so far. Uh, factory. Okay, here we have it. So what we have got the default Laravel structure, we got users post, which we have created and the default st structure of Laravel database. Now, in order to create factory, let's go to the database factories. We have created post factory. Now let's start the operation. The name, let's create a fake name. We're gonna say fake. 
Then let's take sentence for email, image, my bad. I'm going to take fake image URL. Excerpt is a sort of small description. Let's take a fake paragraph. And so with the, the body, the paragraph, that's pretty much it. Now, in order to run the factory, we may want it to go to seeders, go to the default seeder. And I'm going to say app models, the name of the model going to be post. Let's say factory, the number of dummy we want, let's say 20 and creates. That's pretty much it. So now what we are supposed to do, just all we got to do, create the seed command, run the seed command, my bad. And that is it. It is working. Now, if I go to the database, if we see we have 20 post dummy details right here. Here's the name, image, excerpt, body created and blah, blah, blah. This is how it is. Pretty simple, easy peasy. If you have any question, feel free to comment below and I would love to help you out. Have a good one. Cheers.